All right, I'd like to demonstrate a field goal attempt. San Francisco has the ball. It's fourth down. They reached the defenses or Baltimore's 31-yard line, and San Francisco sends out their primary place kicker. Now, in one of our first videos, we learned how to determine the team's kickoff specialist by the acronym KO, which stood for kickoff, and the hyphen A determined that was the team's primary kickoff specialist, and the hyphen P just indicated your reading from the P column. Well, when it comes to place kickers, you're looking for the acronym KA. KA indicates that Akers is the 49ers primary place kicker. If that was KB, he would be the team's secondary in the event that the primary was injured, uh, then KB would come on. The hyphen K just indicates this is the column that we're going to read the play result from. So let's go ahead and try the field goal. Dice roll 16. 16 on Acres card is a 9. Let's go to the kicking and returns table and we look for kicking. Now we have a few columns. You have XP which stands for extra point, uh, field goal to uh, from goal line to 9-yard line, from the 10 to the 19, from the 20 to 29, etc. These columns are for where the football currently resides on the field. So right now the ball is positioned at the defense's 31-yard line. So we're going to use field goal column 30 to 39. Now the play result was a 9 on David Aker's card. So, NG means this is no good. So the field goal attempt would be no good. Let's say for argument's sake it was a 5 and you see where it says 30 good. What that means is if the kick was from the 30 it would be good. But in this situation it was from the 31 so it would not be good. But if I roll to play result 3, you see how it says 37 good? The field, this example, would be good. Any field goal attempt from 30, 37 yards uh, and less would be good. If I was attempting a 38 yarder and I rolled play result 3, then it would be no good because it's 37 and good. Alright, so for this example, I had play result 9, it was no good. So this is going to be logged as a half of play. But now we have to understand how far of a field goal attempt this was. If you're playing any season from 1974 to the current date, the goal posts are positioned in the back of the end zone, i.e. they're 10 yards back. All right. The snap to the holder, the holder is always positioned 7 yards behind the line of scrimmage. So from 74 to present day, you add 17 yards to the line of scrimmage. So this is 31 plus 17. This was a 48 yard attempt that David Akers missed. If I was using a season prior to 74, like I was doing a 69 season, then this would have been a 38 yard miss because you only add 7 because the goal post at that point in time was on the goal line. 